Some of y'all are really out here defending why you should be able to complain about your kid on social media. No, it is not venting. No, it doesn't make anything better. It is complaining. It is taking away all of your responsibility as the parent, as the adult, as the person in charge, and is putting it on your kid. Because as good as it feels in the moment to complain and to get double clicks and to get likes and to get followers and to get all that sort of stuff, people go mega viral on their kids. As good as that feels in the moment, you're gonna wake up the next day and the behavior is going to be the same. So no, I'm not saying ignore the reality. And I'm not just saying positive thinking. I'm not even a positive thinker. <laughs> this is not about positivity. It's about being honest. Your kid is amazing. Your kid is beautiful. Your kid is smart. Your kid is capable. But if you don't see them as that, it's never gonna shift. So yes, there's a little bit of mindset here, but once you believe it, once you believe they are capable, it puts the onus on you to make a change. You don't wake up and just think positive. Oh, my kid's amazing. It's gonna go great today. No, they're gonna do the same today they did yesterday. You wake up and you say, okay, my kid is amazing. So if they're not getting it right now, what can I do to change, right? They can do it, but they're not. So what do I change? That's the difference, okay? That's the difference. When you complain, you say it's their fault. There's nothing I can do about it. When you process and you make action, that's when you wake up and the next day is better. And I promise you that's gonna feel way better than the instant gratification you get from social media.